Welcome back to the Online Education Success Series of the Explorations Network. I'm excited for today's show because we will be tearing into personal enrichment. <laughs> Hi, I'm Avi Anderson and this is the Explorations Learning Network. As we've pointed out in previous episodes, online learning can be fun, exciting, and personally enriching. Aside from all the traditional academic classes, there are many different things you can learn about online, like travel planning, do-it-yourself projects like redecorating your kitchen, konnichiwa, ogenki desu ka, fencing, even rock climbing. Along with colleges and universities, Private online providers are creating classes that teach people how to do many useful things. You can learn from amazing resources online, often for free. Services like YouTube and Vimeo allow people to post their own do-it-yourself episodes on a wide range of topics. Just remember that although the information is good, you may want to get a second opinion before you watch a YouTube video on fixing your brakes or performing brain surgery. Remember, you need a license to do one of these activities. Similar sites like the Do-It-Yourself Network, How Stuff Works, and Wikiversity offer free courses on all kinds of subjects, as do most hardware stores and appliance companies. Here are a few other free sites where you can learn about almost anything. Mrs. O's House, online activities on hundreds of subjects. Exploratorium's 10 cool websites, NASA, the Louvre Museum, the New York Public Library, the Internet Public Library, the Library of Congress, and the National Library of Medicine. In some cases, though, you may want to pay for your learning. You can subscribe to a variety of e-learning providers, do-it-yourself networks, and other education providers, such as BBC Languages, LiveMocha.com, Babbel.com, Busu.com, Luens, or through apps like Life. Cooking classes and cooking apps abound for online chefs. There are even cooking classes and apps that will email you not only recipes, but grocery lists and coupons for that special Moroccan, Thai, French, German, um, Italian, Puerto Rican, Mexican, Ethiopian, or my favorite, Indian meal that you want to prepare. Some cooking sites even help you plan your meals for better nutrition. There are even special classes to help you get the most from your heart-healthy, diabetic, gluten-free, vegan, or low-sodium diet. Fitness is another area you should check out. There are sites and apps that will teach you proper exercise techniques, yoga, Pilates, weightlifting, aerobics, Zumba, and belly dancing. You can also learn how to use supportive technology like the Jawbone Bracelet that monitors your vital statistics such as heart rate, respiration, and blood pressure, and even helps you wake up refreshed. So not all online learning has to come from colleges and universities. You won't get credit for visiting these do-it-yourself sites, but you will gain valuable knowledge. And I'm all about teaching a person how to fish. The Explorations Learning Network is a production of Clark College and is sponsored through generous donations and the support of students and faculty. Mark Gaither is our producer and director, and this episode was sponsored through a Department of Labor grant administered by the Washington State Workforce Training and Education Coordinating Board. The Workforce Training and Education Coordinating Board is a partnership of labor, business, and government dedicated to helping Washington residents obtain and succeed in family wage jobs while meeting employers' needs for skilled workers. I'm Aviance Anderson for the Explorations Learning Network, advancing learning for the information age.